welcome back to Grace's room. So if you watched my deep cleaning my room video I filmed a couple of weeks ago, you might have remembered me mentioning that I was going to clean these cupboards in a later video. Well, the weather outside is like really bad today, so I thought it would be the perfect opportunity to finally clean them. So today I think what I need to do is obviously just go through all my clothes. There might be a couple of things in there that I don't want anymore. Um, and I also think that I'm going to clean these three shelves here because they're probably a little bit dusty and need a bit of an organize. Um, these top cupboards up here, I have them in each cupboard. Uh, so these top shelves. I'm not going to be cleaning. I'm going to leave them because I am actually planning on mm, doing a bit of a room makeover, just a little one. Um, so I might leave those for a later date. Stay tuned for that. Uh, all the clothes that I'm going to be um, getting rid of, I might either give to my younger cousin, um, I might donate them. But I was also thinking of maybe um, opening up a Depop account and putting them on there. So let me know in the comments if you might be interested in that. Anyway, let's get to cleaning. So we'll start off with this end cupboard and work our way um, across. So I think I'm going to just start off with this section up here. I've got all my jackets. The first thing I'm going to be doing, I have this little cute um, Minnie Mouse suitcase that I think I'm going to put downstairs just so I have a little bit more room. So I'll just put that over there. And I also have these wall stickers that I brought when I when we originally moved into this house I was planning on putting these on the wall but that never happened so I might also put these downstairs or maybe give them to someone else perfect so um I have two dressing gowns here I'm also not getting rid of this I might get rid of this one here it's just to spare one that I used to wear all the time but I don't wear it anymore so I might Give it away. Hmm. Just wondering about. I did get a couple of wears out of this jacket, but I don't really wear it that much anymore. If I wear like a nicer jacket, I usually wear this this blazer one here, if you can see. So I might um, give this one away. This one, however, it's just this Calvin Klein jacket that I've had for a little while, so I think I might get rid of this one. It's a bit small on me now. All right, well, I didn't really have too many things that I wanted to get rid of here, so let's move on to this drawer. I've got all my pajamas in them. It's a little bit messy. Might get rid of these ones. They are way too small for me now. I think I'm gonna get rid of this top here. Don't wear it anymore. I think this is a little bit too small on me now. It's, a bit of, it's like a nighty. All right, I think the pajama drawers are probably a lot in there that I wanted to get rid of. They're all fine on me, but I think I might get rid of these. They're really cute, these Mickey Mouse ones, but I think I don't really wear them anymore though, so it's probably no point keeping them. All right, um, next drawer. This one here has got a bunch of like jumpers and long sleeve tops in them. Um, I'm not sure where to start here. This is like a poncho thing that I thought I would wear, but I never did end up wearing it. I got it from like my older cousin, so I could always just give it to my younger cousin. <laughs> Ooh, this one here, I used to love wearing. It's from pink, but I don't wear it anymore. So I might say goodbye to that one. Ooh. I don't know. It's like, I probably could still keep this. My only thing is that I don't wear it anymore. I don't really wear cropped hoodies that much, so I don't know if there's any point in keeping it. Someone else might find better use out of this one. Um, I have this tie-dye top here that I promised myself I would like cut and make look really pretty, but I have not done that, so I think it might be time to say goodbye to this one. This is just like a long sleeve pink shirt. I don't wear it that much, so. Oh, this one here actually. I, mean, I used to be obsessed with this top, but I tried it on the other day and I don't know, it didn't really look that good on me anymore. So I might also say goodbye to that. All right, I think that is all for this drawer. This one here is the disaster drawer. I've got all my t-shirts in here and I'm like obsessed with t-shirts. So <laughs> there's probably way too many in here and there might be some that I might need to get rid of. Um, 
starting off, sadly, I might have to say goodbye to the famous tie-dye shirt. This was like the first one that I ever did. Mm. This one I tie-dyed recently, and it kind of didn't really turn out the way I wanted it to. So I don't know if I really want to keep it anymore. I kind of feel bad though. Mm, <laughs> we have another tie-dye. <laughs> yeah, I don't really wear green that much. I feel like I remember almost getting rid of this top in like another cleaning out my cupboard thing and I didn't get rid of it because I thought I would wear it again and I never ended up wearing it again. Bye bye. This one as well, I don't wear it at all. I think I got it in Hawaii, Forever 21. Mm, I never wore this top. I think I need to get rid of it. This one I got at Gap in Hong Kong maybe? This used to be one of my favorite tops, but I don't really wear it that much anymore, so probably no point keeping it. This one here I got in London and I wore it once maybe. I don't think I really want it that much anymore. I think this used to be my mum's old top, but I never ended up wearing it. I ended up keeping this one, I don't know why, because I thought I said that it was too small on me. So I think I definitely need to get rid of it. It's way too small. <laughs> These three here are like singlets I got from... Was it Forever 21 or something? I might keep this colour. This is a cute colour, but these two I might get rid of. This one here is from Factory. I don't think I really like the colours that much anymore. Mm. And I don't really wear this one that much anymore. All right, one more top, one more top. I'm just really looking back at that white one. I want to find get rid of some of these. Nah. Okay, now I think I'm finally done with this um, section. That was kind of difficult because like I said, I'm just really indecisive and I don't want to get rid of things. This drawer here, I've never really cleaned out that much. Um, it has like some old primary school clothes in here, some of my tie-dye things, and just some tops that didn't, never fit in this um, t-shirt section. Um, so, might be a couple of things I might be able to get rid of. A couple of tie-dye things here. I remember every time there'd be leftover dye, I would just get a bunch of like old white clothes, like singlets and stuff, and I would just tie-dye using the rest of it. But I think I have to keep my hard rock ones because I was obsessed with these tops at one point. <laughs> um, when flannels came back, was it 2017 or something like that? I stole some of my dad's old ones. I did not end up wearing it. I remember my mum really wanted me to keep this top because it was like, I used to wear it like all the time. But I don't think I want to keep it. <laughs> oh, it's a mini mouse scarf. I can't get rid of that. <laughs> this was like my old primary school bomber jacket. Um, I think I might only keep two things from my primary school collection, so I might get rid of that. This was my old summer dress. I have to keep this, that is so cute. Okay, so all these keepsakes that I'm keeping, I think I'm just gonna put on one side of the drawer, so that way maybe I can put some shoes on the other side. That drawer is finally done. I had to fold up a couple things, but I definitely freed up a lot of space in there. So that's good. All right, that wraps up this cupboard and we have quite a nice pile of clothes at the moment. Ooh, I was actually not expecting that much. I don't think I've been through that bottom drawer in like such a long time. So it's probably not so surprising that there's so much stuff there. Okay, this cupboard, um, just a bunch of like hanging things obviously. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. Um, again I think I'm going to try to be a little bit ruthless because I remember last time I kept a lot of things that I probably don't wear anymore. Starting off with this top here, I don't wear it anymore. This was the hoodie that I sewed in textiles. I don't know if I should keep it because it was like a good creation but it's not the prettiest thing in the world so. Well I got this one in Europe somewhere, I don't remember. 
but I don't really wear it anymore. I used to love wearing it though. This top here I remember getting because I was really obsessed with um, Eddie from It, but I don't wear it. I'm not sure what to do with this top. Uh, maybe I could put it in the keepsake drawer because I kept it for a long time because it's like so cute. But I don't obviously wear it. Okay, it might finally be time to part with this top. Mum will probably find it in the pile later and force me to keep it though. <laughs> like a tie-up shirt or something. It's really cute, but I just haven't worn it, so there's really no point in me keeping it. And finally, don't wear this one that much either. Okay, now it's time to go through some skirts. Starting off with this one here, which I was waiting to grow into because um, it was too big for me, but I don't think I'd really wear it anymore. Just like this pencil skirt. I think I got it for like a shoot I was doing or something, but I don't wear it. Okay, um, that's all for this section here. I think I did pretty well. Actually, there was one jumper in here that I was tossing up. Because I remember I got it custom made at um, Comic Con when I went. It was like a Southside one from Riverdale, but I think I have enough oversized jumpers. Okay, I think that's all. Um, these boxes here, I have some shoes here, but I think maybe at the end when I go through my shoe drawer in the next cupboard, I'll organize the shoes and these um, boxes here with some bags and then I think I'll put it in that cupboard as well, but obviously I'll wait till I organize that. So let's just move on to this last section here with my dresses. Um, as much as I would love to get rid of all my school clothes, sadly I can't, so I'll just put those to the side. Um, this dress here I've had for a little while, but it's a little bit gothic. I don't think it's really my style that much. This dress here I don't really wear anymore. Just another plain black dress that I don't wear. I have a feeling this is too small for me and I also don't really wear it. This here, I remember I really wanted my, um, I really wanted to get and then I bought it and then I never wore it and I feel really bad but I don't really wear play suits that much. So, goodbye. Um, this dress here, we don't wear as much anymore. Okay, I held on to this top for way too long. This has like made it through so many um, cleaning up my closet videos. It's, it, I just have to get rid of it now. I'm not going to wear it. <laughs> mm, I think I tried this on during the summer this year and it didn't fit me anymore. This was like, I think I wore it for my 13th birthday, so it does have a couple of special memories attached to it, but I think it's time to move on. And this one here, I think I got it from Urban Outfitters in London, but I only wore it a couple of times. I think it's a play suit. It looks a bit like a skirt. Anyway, probably no point keeping that, although it's kind of cute. Alright, I think that's all for this cupboard, which means we're on to our final cupboard here, which will probably take a little while, because I have a couple of shelves and stuff. Um, I'll just quickly go through the drawers. Ooh. These ones here, I remember I bought, was it in Barcelona or something? Because I thought that if those flare pants with like the cool patterns on them were in, but then I ended up hating them after I bought them, so probably no point in me keeping those. I think these were a pair of jeans and I ended up thrifting into like some shorts, but I don't really wear these. I remember I put these shorts on during the summertime and they didn't really fit me that well anymore, so I might have to get rid of these. Okay, I think that's pretty much all for this drawer. I feel like I went through it pretty recently. There's not really a lot that I need to get rid of. Alright, moving along. Ugh, this is a disaster, this drawer. I've just got a bunch of bathers in here. I think I showed you guys this already, but I'm going to show you again. It's the dress that I sewed, and I cannot force myself to get rid of this, so I might put it in that little keepsake drawer. 
All right, um, let's see. I've got a couple belts in here that maybe I can get rid of. This is a bit of a disaster. All right, where are any of these? Gosh, that pile is really getting tall. Right, I put these bathers on recently and they were not very flattering, so I'll not be keeping those. Alright, that drawer um, is a lot cleaner. And finally, this is my shoe drawer, which is absolutely crazy. <laughs> I have a perfume here, a very old one. I don't know why it's in there. It wouldn't fit on my shelf, so I'll get rid of that. Um, okay, I'm not really sure what to do with this one. I think I might just like organize it, get rid of the things that I don't want anymore. And then um, I'll like split it in half so some of it can go in that cupboard over there where I made all that space. And some I can obviously keep in here. But there might be a couple of things that I don't want anymore. Like these shoes that I tie-dyed, I don't really wear. It's like my first pair of slides, they're a bit old now. These were my custom um, Air Forces that I did uh, a couple years ago. And they're so cute, but I don't really wear them. Whew, wow, these fillers have really been through it. I think it might be time to depart. Um, but these ones are still in good condition. Can someone please bring fillers back in style? I want to wear these again, but everyone tells me that they're not really in fashion at the moment. So I haven't worn them, but I kind of want to. Maybe I should just wear them. And then... My Ugg boots, which I love wearing in the winter time. Alright, I've got some boxes here with some shoes. I might be able to take them out of the boxes, but I think anything in boxes I'm going to put in that cupboard over there. I might keep them in there actually. So I think I'm just going to put everything back in here and then see how much room I have left. I have never had so much room in this shoe drawer. It's actually ridiculous. Wow. <laughs> okay, that's like, that's really nice actually. It's very satisfying to have such a roomy space in there because I would always have to take everything out if I just wanted to get one pair of shoes. Anyway, let's put these boxes in this cupboard here. They all fit so nicely in there. That's actually really satisfying. Well, this cupboard is officially done. Now it's time to move on to these three shelves, which I'm not really looking forward to because <laughs> they're a disaster, mainly this one up here. Um, this one should be fine. I think I'm just gonna take everything out and just give it a quick little dust. Okay, so this shelf is all organized now. I managed to get rid of a couple of perfumes and body mists that I didn't really want anymore. And it definitely looks a lot tidier and there is no more dust. So let's go on to this second um, shelf here, which has just got a bunch of bags and like other little like boxes and stuff like that. Okay, this shelf is all finished. Um, a bit of an open space here. I wasn't, really, I wasn't really sure how to organize this. I also got those boxes from the other cupboard and I put them here. I think they look really cute, but it will do for now. This third shelf up here is the last one I'm gonna organize today. Um, I'm really not sure what's up here. I think I've just got like some coloring pencils, books, and perfume boxes maybe. I feel like I need a step, step ladder to get up here, but let's start organizing. Alright, that's that 
bookshelf all cleaned up. It definitely looks a lot neater than it did before, but there probably is still a few things in there that I selfishly kept. <laughs> all right, well, this cupboard is finally all cleaned and that pretty much wraps up this closet clean out. Like I said, I'll get to those top shelves one day. Stay tuned for that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, let me know if you want me to maybe like open up a Depop if you're interested in any of these clothes. Otherwise, they'll be going to my cousin. <laughs> um, don't forget to check out my Instagram at Grace's World Official and I'll see you guys next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now.